Hey Luke Kaiser, and welcome back to the Into the Simpsons Verse update. We've got a lot of different colors on the screen. We've got yellows and pinks and purples and blues. That's all about to change. At least for one character. Are you sure you want to do this? There are a lot of great things about the future that you haven't seen yet. Did you know they can fry Oreos now? Also, a phone to connect us to all of the world's information. Plus, it's misinformation and it's disinformation. Save it. I'm reversing this portal and that's all there is to it. Well, it was nice knowing you. I'll never forget the town that you believed me when I framed Lenny for stealing the company donuts. Farewell, Homer. I hope we can steer this town back on track. Flip switch. Hmm, I think something is wrong. Is that music I hear? Oh no, something is definitely wrong. Someone is coming through the portal. Ooh, a big reveal just before the end of the first part of the story. I can't wait to see who it is. I'm glad we avoided the classic Hollywood crutch using cliffhangers. Man, are people fed up with those? We need instant gratification. What's a cliffhanger? Oh, you know, it's that cheap gimmick where you cut things off right before the big reveal. Alright. Oh, like if we just stopped talking now and didn't show who was coming through the portal? Exactly. You son of a gun! I know him. So, did they cut it off? I'll take your kiss, but it'll cost you a dollar a day. That's the going rate these days, right? Noir Homer. And... Uh, I've now got three characters, I believe. That's right. One... Two, three. Wow, he looks so strange. Like, I know I've already got New Orleans. Man, this adds a lot of flavor. A lot of flavor to your town, you know what I mean? So you should have a voice. The question is, what sound clips is Noah Homer going to have? I'm sorry? Do you wig him? Who you looking for this one? What happened to, like, reading me my rights, man? We both know that'd be a waste of time with a slime ball like you. You didn't read him his rights? Sorry, detective, but we're gonna have to let him go. I won't tell if you won't. Winks. Looks like you got something in your eye there. So we're gonna be slow on the uptake which we've done, and Noah Homer had to explain winking. I don't know what the heck you're saying, man. I'm gonna have to crank the volume up here. Hold on. Past the potatoes. I think he's saying past the potatoes? The I think it's past the potatoes. What? You're letting him go? Sorry, but rules are rules. I can't believe that worked. So long, suckers. I think we'll get Snake. Past the potatoes. Wow, so you're from the 1930s? And back then he didn't have to worry about people's rights or anything? Darn straight. Well, there's been a lot of changes since then. Man, it sure would be nice not to have to deal with those whining pups in their rights, though. Darn right. In my day, the only law was that your suit had to match your fedora. And that you had your name painted on the glass part of the door to your office. And you had a wisecracking secretary who carried a torch for you, but you treated like a kid sister. I think there may have been something about death slams, too. When I think about it, there were a lot of laws. You know, I got another case I'm working if you want to take along. Happy to show you how we did things back in my day. Really? You don't think anyone would mind if I leave my post in the middle of the day to follow around a private eye? I won't tell if you won't. Winks. You really need to get your eye checked out. Tell you what, I'll bring one of our med kits for the road. Wow, he really is slow, isn't he? Take Wiggum on a case, grab a med kit. Ah, yeah! It's gonna be like Crack and not much inside. Past the potatoes. Okay, we're here. You watch my back. I'm gonna kick down the door on three. Ready? Whoa, whoa! You need a warrant for that. A warrant? Pfft. I'm pretty sure I heard screams from inside. You do? I don't hear anything. Oh. Oh! Gee, mister, that's pretty clever. But like I said, we can't do that kind of stuff around here. Then how are we supposed to get anything done? By going through the red tape, let me just call this in. 
Sigh. Fine. I'm gonna listen to my favorite show while you do all that. What station carries the Bromo Seltzer Murder Hour? We don't have that. When we're bored, we text on our phones. Hmm. The detective emoji reminds me of someone. Listen to the radio. Are we gonna get our first animation? Let's find out. We are. The question is, what the size of the radio gonna be? Hey, sweetheart, lock your lips in this garage. Why is he laughing at him? Wait, what? Oh, he took it. And the guy's is like, Mapple Pad. He's like, ooh, I'll take that. Those hipsters, man, I tell you. They like anything old and vintage. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be like Homer's skull. Hard to crack and not much inside. Great news. The hearing's been arranged with the judge tomorrow morning for the warrants. Great. I love sitting idly by while the criminals get a 24 hour lead head start on me. Really? I love sitting idly by too. Here, let me show you a few games we learned on the forest that you can play sitting down. Well, that's every game I know. So, what's the next move while we wait for the warrant? I think it's time to go undercover. Ooh, can I be a cowboy? I've always wanted to go undercover as a cowboy. Uh, I don't think that's gonna work here. Here, let me show you how it gets done. Go undercover. So we're gonna get our second and final animation. And Wiggum's gonna be in a big can. You know, he is in a, a big can in, in sorts with a premium character. Someone call 911. Which is... Right here. Beer Stein Wiggum. Oh yeah. Yep, second and final animation. Let's see how sleuthy Noah Homer can be. Hey, sweetheart, lock your lips in this garage. Uh, what happened there for a second? Was it the wind? Ah, uh, the wind ruined his mystique. It does look pretty sleuthy, though. It does remind me. Oh, and he walks like that, too? Oh, man, that's great. It definitely has an old-school detective feel, just the, the position that he's in. You know, most characters, they walk normal, or in some situations, you know, they're driving a car or something. But, I mean, this is completely unique. Obviously the look, but this animation is definitely just as unique as that. Yep, just give me a second here. Uh, yeah, if you could just roll me that way, it's kind of hard to move inside this big can. Why are you in a big can? It's my undercover caution. You didn't give me any time to prepare. I had to improvise. Get out of the can. Gasp. Look, there's our perp. Stop right there. You're under arrest. Yeah, stop right there. Police. I'm... I'm stuck. Can you help me out? Hands up. I surrender. Hans Mole Man's gonna get arrested. <laughs> gonna be like Homer's skull. Hard to crack and not much inside. Looks like we finally caught the breakneck break in bandana bandits. A who? Don't you read your own police reports? Those are confidential. Probably shouldn't have mentioned that, but look at him. He fits the profile. Should he be wearing a bandana? He obviously took it off to try and confuse us. And he's supposed to be the mastermind at Super Fast Breakers. With a cane? Pfft, it's obviously a ruse. Kicks Hond Moment's cane. Falls to the ground. Gah! Uh huh, quite a performance. Ah, uh, this is gonna be so much paperwork. No, no, I wanna, I wanna explore this more and, and see what's gonna happen. Well, yeah, that is the full walkthrough for Noah Homer. So he's obviously voiced. I love his voice clips so much. And both animations are pretty great as well. I love the second one, the sleuthing one. I love the mysteriousness of it. And just the way he walks. It's very, very creative. And you get this if you are doing the event and complete the first act. 
Is that anybody watching this for the first time or maybe have never played The Simpsons Tapped Out? You can still get this. You're going to have to get to level 15 to start, but I mean, you still have a lot of time remaining. You should be able to get this. I just want to say thank you to anybody who is watching this video and taking time out of your day to check this out. Like usual though, if you did enjoy the video, please give it a like, a thumbs up, let me know that you enjoyed what you saw. And I will see you with Act 2 just around the corner. Move forward in this month-long Simpsons vs. Update. So thank you very so much for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye everybody.